All right, guys, welcome into war number two of season 43. This is going to be SSX versus Legion. I've got a super easy war, so this is going to be a quick video. First up, we go path one. We get Torch against Mephisto. I forget what the nodes are. Some regen, um, maybe mask, I don't even remember. But a Torch versus Mephisto fight is free. I even play really bad, so I'm super nervous heading into these. I got the last four fights to finish off the donut, and even though they're super easy, just being in that scenario gets you really nervous. But this, the matchups were all perfect. It was really easy fights, really easy plan by my officer, so got to appreciate that. Next up, we'll have Hulkling versus Shuri. Again... We get the Reinvigorated Fury, Maskism, and I'm not sure what the third note is, but none of them really matter to this fight at all. It's just you can't parry her, so block for heavy, block bait heavies, or, you know, decks out of SP1 to get openings. This was only a six star rank four, too. With a champ that's got a seven star out, it's crazy that nobody in this battle group has one. Now, maybe they wanted to keep this one on defense because if she is awakened, you can't throw an unblockable special into her, but I don't know. doesn't seem like the play. After this, we're going to move on to path six in section two. Uh, first fight is a bishop. I'm taking that with future Ant-Man. I've never used future Ant-Man before, uh, but the globe was down. He can control the prowess. Bishop's not going to be too much of a problem. Again, just a rank four. This is crazy. Uh, yeah, so you guys can see I'm way over boosted here. But we are taking nothing for granted since this is going to be the last couple fights for the donut. My game plan coming into this was just block bait heavy. You know, four hits, hold block, four hits, hold block. I wanted to throw an SP2 first. I couldn't really decide. Because I don't use this guy too much, so... I didn't have the best feel on what I should be doing when I came to the specials. This one right here probably should have just been four hits into SP2. But I finished with a light, and that's why he threw his SP1. So that's something that I just got to get a handle on. And then this next one, I do throw the SP2, but since I don't have the Surging Swarm passive thingy, I don't get big damage. But obviously, this is just a super easy fight. So, in and out. No issues there. And the final one is going to be Long Shot. This is the Do Not Disturb, and when you block their specials, they get Palace Passives. That was dangerous right there, them starting me on Hulkling. One slip up and I'm dead. Healing up just to be safe. Feel good about the fight though. I'm not gonna be an issue. Or it's I think this is another rank four, yeah. Just a rank four long shot. It's crazy. This alliance does not rank for defense at all. Yeah, so in this one I'm just baiting heavies. You don't want to parry, you don't want to get the disorient on you, especially not early. Maybe later, it's fine. I wanted to start pushing his specials to get some openings. I wanted to get him the special twos. There's an easy intercept. Now we bait special two. Can block this, you know, he can have the palace press of no big deal. SP2, he's going to start chunking pretty hard. I don't want to push him special three, so I back out of there, but he's probably going to tick away anyways. And that's it. Easy war. GG's to Legion. We get a win and a donut. Thanks for watching. Bye.